okay, let's try this again. I keep trying to do videos and my phone just does not want to cooperate. Um, I was in the middle of a nice little rant and it just like kind of shut down on me. Um, yeah. Uh, so, uh, this particular video, I'm trying to collect my thoughts and so I can regurgitate them for y'all and because I was not expecting to have to redo this video yet again, but uh, this particular video is on an article I read on Yahoo News. It was on uh, how the Obama administration knew about the Russian collusion, you know, Russian tampering, if you will, hacking, whatever, months in advance. And they were ordered to stand down, and that was in quotes. And that it was decided that Obama should would it be better off with Obama giving Vladimir Putin a, I believe the exact words were, strong talking to. Now, I don't mean this to be disrespectful. But compared to Vladimir Putin, Barack Obama is a pansy boy. I'm not being disrespectful. Let's face it, Putin is an ex-officer of the KGB. They're not, they were not nice people. That's part of the Soviet Union. The Soviet Union was not nice people. They were known for sending people to Siberia to die, or just executing them. Look up the Gulag, too, uh, G-U-L-A-G. They had, it was a forced labor and, uh, yeah, um, execution camps based upon the designs of uh, the Nazi German uh, Nazi concentration camps. Matter of fact, Stalin and uh, prior to uh, Hitler turning on Stalin, Stalin and Hitler worked together to uh, actually design these camps. But so that gives you an idea as to the nature of the Soviet Union. So if you think anything Obama could really say or do could intimidate Vladimir Putin, no, because Vladimir Putin could probably kill a bear with his bare hands. So no, that would not work if anything. It probably made matters worse. So, and they had then known this would not have worked. So the more I think about it, the more I wonder why would they have thought that would have been the best idea? The only thing I can think of is it was a contingency plan. Just think about how much they pushed the narrative of Russian collusion to get Trump elected. How it started when... Trump started gaining on Hillary in the polls just a wee bit. How that's when it came up. Convenient, right? Convenient, right? And then you find out, you know, top members of the Democrat Party and top members of the admin of the administration of that time knew it was happening and said, "Don't do anything. Stand down." No, that's. That's very hinky. I don't believe in coincidences, especially none that big. I firmly believe that was a, that Russian, the Russian hacking and whatnot was a contingency plan in case Trump won, because they were. I mean, that's less a sign of Russian meddling than the Democrat Party meddling, in my not so humble opinion. We know they did because they. It did come out that they worked to get make sure Hillary won the uh, nomination, which shot him in the foot because I firmly believe Bernie would have won, and not just like it went down with the election. There wouldn't the electoral college wouldn't have mattered by the blowout because Hillary did more to excite. You know, people vote for voting for Trump than Trump did. That's, I mean, that's a fact. There are people who purposefully voted for him just to 
keep her from having being elected. And people stayed at home to avoid voting for her. Voting for both of them especially. But So I firmly believe that was their contingency you know, Russia was the contingency plan in case Trump won. They didn't bank on the fact that it was the con- that uh, apparently even Obama knew that it was going on and did nothing. They weren't banking on that getting out, I don't think. Or that both sides of uh, Congress would be pushing on it, investigating it, and would be upset that it came out, you know, this close to an election. But it, that's what happened. I promise you, they didn't just, they did not think, tell, you know, wagging a finger at Vladimir Putin and saying, don't do this, would work. They knew it would. They knew if anything, it would make him do it more. So, the, that's the only thing I can come to. The only conclusion I can come to is they wanted. Russia to do this. It was all a game of chess or, you know, mind games, whatever you want to call it. But they knew. I think they thought it would be a bit more successful. And I don't think they realized that it would get out that they knew it was happening and did nothing. That's my two cents on it, at least. Uh, if you have an article to the contrary, something that disproves me, feel free to post it. If you have different opinions, feel free to post it. But the more, like I say, the more I think about it, that's the only thing I can come to. They wanted it to happen so I could have a contingency plan. I look forward to your input. I'm going to get off here before my phone die, acts up again, and I, you know, have to try to do this video a third time. Anyway, later.